Good day, fellas. I hope you're ready for your daily dose of skill. Rhino it is. This tank got changed as well a bit, and Wargaming decided to move it. Um, and you know what? People, we are complaining about this tank DPM, so Wargaming uh, buffed armor. <laughs> I'm not even joking, okay? You cannot make it up. Anyways, um, Rhino. As you can see, Wargaming increased at river speed, which is good. Actually, river speed is quality of life. Change, hip hip hooray. Uh, shell velocity of the golden ammunition. It was extremely slow, and I still think it is quite slow for this tank, because standard ammunition is just awesome for this vehicle. And in the same time, Wargaming increased at, um, turret armor by 20 millimeters. Well, let's see how turret armor stands nowadays. So this is how the turret armor is looking like nowadays, right? You are having pretty much from roughly 300 to 310 millimeters of armor. Now let's see how it was looking like before. Before, turret armor was like from 270 to 280. So pretty much 20, 20 millimeters of armor increase. Now let's talk uh, about the real world of tanks. What people are doing whenever they are receiving a heavy tank. Are you surprised? Come on, uh, fellas, shh, don't be surprised. So as you can see, it's paper. Now, if we are going to the current situation, it's still the same paper. So pretty much changes for the Rhino are extremely, extremely minimal. And let's get real. I mean, yeah, sure. If you have a chance to use the uh, to use the gun depression, ideally, uh, obviously, it is looking kind of all right. But to be completely honest with you, I'm pretty sure if you will check out previous patch, it was the same situation. Let's see. Actually, wait a second. Is it is it the same situation? Kind of, yes, kind of the same situation because you won't be able to penetrate it most of the time. As you can see, it's quarter of the change change, right? So I do not really think it changes this vehicle that much whenever you are using the gun depression to the maximum, right? And keep this in mind, it is Rhino. You have a humongous horn on top and even tier 8s can penetrate you, right? So keep this in mind. But... Believe me or not, fellas, I lately played with this tank for my no goal challenge, right? I'm doing those once in a while. And I enjoyed playing with this vehicle with no gold. And I can tell you exactly why. Yes, the PM of the tank is Kako, okay? We are not even talking about this. I am speaking about the standard ammunition, right? Uh, 268 millimeters of penetration and 1.4 shell velocity. It's shooting like Leopard does. This is the best thing about this vehicle, and I do enjoy playing with this tank, with a, uh, even with a standard ammunition. Now, don't get me wrong. I am not saying this tank is awesome, and I am not saying um, this vehicle is the best tank in the world of tanks, or it became uh, even better. I think uh, it is still the same Rhino as it was before, just with tiny touch faster uh, heat ammunition and pretty much just tiny touch better to that armor, which most of the people won't feel the difference. Uh, that's what I think. Anyways, without further ado, let's go into the game and let's see what this bad boy can do, shall we? Mm. Rhino in action. No, let's see what we can do with this vehicle. Now, matchmaking is treating us extremely, extremely well. Uh, we are playing against the tier 8 vehicles, although I am kind of paranoid by going into the ditch. Now hear me out, why am I saying so? This tank doesn't have DPM, right? DPM is the biggest problem of this tank. If it would have like a reverse auto reloader, you know, like IS-3A or something, so you are reloading the last shell the quickest, Maybe it would be a bit better, but in this kind of situation, it is just IAI. Anyways, we are not going to think too much. We are going to push that W, okay? We are going to push that W, or do we want to push that W? No, we do not want to push that w, w, okay? Fair enough. Let's try to spank this 430U in the side. How are you doing? Oh! Oh! Rhino and Rhino gun handling, you are looking ma mwah, mwah, magnificent today. You are looking magnificent today, sir. Beautiful. Okay, we are just waiting until we are going to fully reload. You know, you are missing every single shot you are not taking, fellas. I had a chance to hold my shot, but then we would not see this beauty, right? 
And we want to see this beauty. Hi, how are you doing? That would be, I see, tax for the previous shot which we hit. I see. Okay, okay, tax me. I'm fine. I am fine. Tax me for my luck. Then tax me for my luck, my man. You can go for it. Unfortunate, nothing what I can change there. I think angle was very, very nice. I think we could have penetrated this guy. I think we could uh, show the dominance against him, but there is nothing what I can change about this. If gun is saying no, then gun is saying no. And I really want to highlight one very important thing. I think the gun handling of this vehicle is actually decent. I do not think the gun is um, that bad to um, say, yeah, the Rhino is horrible. No, the gun accuracy is actually all right from this tank. Plus, on top of that, fellas, we have a winning spawn in this kind of situation as well. And I believe this is kind of a worthy thing to highlight. At this point, I'm going in. I mean, I don't care. What are you going to do? To kill me? Haha! -ha. Jokes on you. Greetings, my man. Ch -ch 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 -ch. Love me. Love me. And now we are going to talk, my man. Let me get closer and we are going to talk. Yeah, he has a friend, but I have a friend as well. Look at this. 39. Do, 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 do. Both of us should feel relatively comfortable here. Yes, both of us are autoloaders, but it is kind of hard to push an autoloader, if you know what I mean. Don't hit my friend. No, I said no. Just no. Beautiful. This is exactly what I'm looking for, and now we are going to wait until we will have two in the mag. Whenever we are going to have two in the mag, we are going to peek sideways, because we can, and then we are going to show the dominance against this gentleman. Yeah, actually, let's go now. Hi. Just love me. Just love me. Where you think you are going? Where you think you are going? Good. Good. Very, very good. We are getting tracking damage. It's always nice and always welcome. Now, we need to keep this in mind. They have a star of us somewhere here in the back. And we need to keep in mind our DPM is far away from being excellent. But that's what we have and that's what we need to live with, right? Oh, this escaped. Yeah, we can make pressure like this. Actually, I think we can make pressure for our friend Rhino. Because going around, I mean, I will be like um, the guy who is who is going over the ass of our allies. There is, n It's not worth to do that. Why would I make pressure like this? We cleared this side already, so now we can go. Now, Rhino is a bit dangerous mother trucker because he can kind of fully clip us. But... We will try to take a risk it for the biscuit situation. Uh, also, very, very bad is this Asterva because he has an angle on us as well and I do not really want to um, mess with this guy at this point. Meanwhile, Rhino is sitting here in the back. I can see him right into the horn. Beautiful shot into the horn. Although he penetrated us as well, which is not exactly what I am looking for, but that's what we have. It's okay. We should be all right. Now we are waiting until our guys will arrive, and they will, fellas. They will, there is no chance they are not going to arrive, and we are going to be fine with all this. Meanwhile, right into the horn, bad shot by me, not much what I can change about this. Our Scorpion G is going in front by saying, da -da 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 and that's it. And Rhino is officially dead. I mean, what this gentleman can do about this? Absolutely nothing, fellas. Absolutely nothing. Now... There is a tiny chance, there is no tiny chance, that's it. This is a game over, right? So, for this tank, I would say we played relatively all right. I think we did as much as we could have done in this situation, and this is our performance, right? Um, unfortunately, enemy Amax drowned. Actually, he got drowned by our IS-4, so I, our IS-4 pushed him into the water. He was saying, you stink, you need to take a shower. That's how it went. It's okay. Listen, uh... What we have seen in this game, we have seen the biggest problem of this vehicle, in my humble opinion, that is DPM. DPM is the thing which needed to be um, buffed on this vehicle, not anything else, to be completely honest with you. And once again, I really want to highlight the gun handling of this tank is actually pretty nice and it's pretty good. Um we finished the game with a 3.8 thousand damage, 800 assisting damage. Definitely not ideal game, but it was enough to be top by the damage and third by experience. And we got 46 thousand profits. Hip hip hooray. Let's go for second, shall we? Okay, guys. 
let's see how we can play this game so what do we have first of all we have the ruinberg well the map which is ruining the games usually um i have no chance to play this game just to take the goal of one position the main reason is why we are going there i just simply think uh, it is the best play overall right uh, obviously we can take foxtrot 2 and from foxtrot true we can actually shoot people who are playing here in the mid and so on and in fact let's do that you know what i changed my mind the main reason why i changed my mind we have a crown and we have rhino going over there now skill uh and what is the problem of this well the biggest problem of all this is uh we will fight for the position uh they will push in front i will push in front they will push in front it's going to be pain in the butt so why to have pain when we can have the position for ourselves right this should work very very well now what i want to see i obviously want to see someone making a mistake that is a bit of mistake beautiful very very nice and now we are waiting until TVP will get spotted because I can promise you that he will. Now we have Kran and we have Rhino saying, uh, sitting here. What that basically means, that basically means they will make sure enemies are not going to peek, okay? I am pretty sure about this and this is where the Rhino will shine, right? So we will fully unload because we are feeling great and we are going to sit here and wait until we are going to reload nothing else to do in this situation good and once again kran rhino they are saying boo for the enemies right and that's all we want to see that's all we want to do good very very good now obviously extremely important thing is for us to get some spots here eventually right this is exactly what we need this is exactly what we need, but we will see. Will we have a light tank who is spotting for us or not so much? Also, what might happen, I was about to say, enemies might try to make pressure like this, which which might happen, fellas, but not yet. You see, we have a super conqueror here, and super conqueror is going to look at him uh, being angry, and this is what we want to see. Meanwhile, light tank, actually, that was Udes, excuse me. Uh, by the shape, I was thinking it is a light tank. Look at this beautiful accuracy. <laughs> Mm. This is this is the positive thing about the Rhino. You know what? Believe me or not, I would say Rhino is more as a heavy tank than uh, Minotauro. Um, okay, Rhino is more as a tank destroyer than Minotauro is, and Minotauro is more as a heavy tank than Rhino is. Does it make sense what I'm saying? Pretty much what I want to say as a heavy tank, this is weak. But uh, playing from the distance and being close to support your teammates and whatnot, it can actually work very, very well, right? And this is exactly what we are doing in this kind of situation. Too bad um, Russian light tank has better armor than I do, but, you know, not much what we can change about this. Skill, are you being sarcastic? Sarcastic? Absolutely never, fellas. How dare you to even say something like this? Sarcastic, they said. Sarcastic. Okay. Good. We can easily penetrate mouse into the lower plate, so we do not really need to uh, caco our pants. We are feeling very, very well. Obviously, mouse has a support. He has Rhino in the back, but I couldn't care less about this. All I want to do, I want to shoot him into the lower plate. That's all I want to do. Uh, hi, how are you doing? Enjoying yourself? Good, good to hear that. He is angling very, very well. Oh, I appreciate you, my man. That is a beautiful angling. If you would shoot as well as your angle, that would be even better. Okay, what do we want to do at this point? At this point, we want to take this position, right? I do not want to play with the mouse anymore. We have two heat 907s. You know what they are going to do for him? Uh, guess what will happen for this gentleman? Yeah, he will be sent to the garage, right? Meanwhile, Coppola shot, not a big problem. This tank can uh, utilize shots like, like this. I truly mean it, fellas. And I'm not saying that to make, uh, to make this tank look better. I truly believe in the gun handling of this vehicle. Aka, the gun handling of this tank is not bad whatsoever, you know? There is many things which is which are bad on this tank, but gun handling is not one of those, right? 
Beautiful, we can shoot him once again, that's what we are going to do, and he is officially dead. Beautiful game, I think we played for perfection, we should have two blind shots, so this should be 5.5, 5 5.6 5 thousand damage, and once again, we did everything properly here, fellas. Uh, the most important thing was the combination of the things, we had two guys in the golf, uh, one area, what those guys did, they, they should hold down and you cannot do anything, but they are giving a fear factor for enemies to push in front um and that was the best thing for us that's why we could afford to play uh in the middle as well and since um and since we had people on the field who were brave obviously we got spots and what spots means that means damage 5.6 thousand damage very 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 good game i am super happy about this and in the end of the day we finish at third by experience but first by the damage and in the same time we made 40 thousand profits one more highlight about this tank you do not need that much of the gold ammunition and if we are looking into the booths what were gaming buffet they buffed gold ammunition right uh, from 750 meters to 925 but why would you shoot gold if you can shoot standards which uh, which are flying like crazy mother truckers you get the point what i'm saying yeah against the mouse uh, gold is good uh, hip hip hooray but you do not want to be that first person who is charging in front as well you know you want to be smart with this vehicle anyways that is a second game let's go for a third one shall we Okay, guys, we have a new map. Um, I do not know how to play it. I must admit it. I am just as clueless as this mouse is, okay? Both of us are smiling and both of us are thinking. Meanwhile, our Manticore, where I can spot here, I have no clue. Don't worry, my man, you are not alone. No one knows how to play this map. I can promise you that. So, the best thing of all this is, obviously, it is a kind of heavy map in a way, right? It's clear what to do with the heavy tanks. You see this line over there? Well, that's where heavy tank, uh, tanks are playing, right? So we are simply heading there and we will uh, and we will try to do our best, right? Ooh! I think Waza might be baboon, but I might be wrong as well. Anyways, let's see. How many heavy tanks do we have? We have enough heavy tanks, at least I want to believe that. But once again, the heaviest we are going to deal against, it's going to be a bit of the stinker. Super Conquerors are going to be... Oh, think about vacations, fellas. Think about vacations over there. You are chilling in this beautiful house and you are looking into this humongous uh, erupting volcano. Not the best uh, idea for vacations, fellas. I would not recommend this. I would not recommend this. Hell no. Absolutely not. I change my mind, fellas. Don't mind me if I do. Now, overall, the views around are gorgeous, okay? It feels like this game is made in 2022 or something, right? 2023, whatever, right? It truly feels very, very, very nice. Okay. Uh, what are we supposed to do here? Peep, 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 get me out of here. I cannot push in front. Uh, this is what this gentleman is saying, and I cannot blame him. I cannot blame him. You know what? Uh, the best thing of all this is Leo died, okay? So since Leo is dead, we can try to make a bit of pressure like this. How good of the hold down they have? Oh, that is a perfect hold down for him. Ooh. That is a perfect cooldown. I need hits in order to penetrate him. And I do not want to load the hits yet. We have a lot of forces here. Fellas, we got this. Let's go in. I think we can afford this. Oh, hi. How are you doing? Ooh, you have fire extinguisher? Oh, that is a big disappointment, sir. That is a big disappointment. How dare you to have fire extinguisher in World of Tanks in 2023? Outrageous. Obviously, I am uh, I am messing with him and fire extinguisher is actually not a horrible idea for their tank, right? Because their tank can burn quite often. Relax, take it easy. We got this Mr. Mouse is saying, oh, my team needs my hit points. Uh, indeed, we need your hit points. Could you please go in front? No? No, no means no. We understood. Once again, in this situation, we are just trying to be annoying for uh, for the enemies. That is the whole uh, point and that is the whole plan. 
Good side scrapping here, nothing to do. I took the second for the team from this guy and uh, uh, there is nothing what I can change about this. I thought he is looking towards the enemies, but I was a bit wrong. Oh, ho, 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 ho. you forgot the fire extinguisher, sir? Unfortunate. Um, unfortunate. I want to see this mouse shooting. Whenever this mouse will shoot, we can make pressure for this Rhino. Or uh, I suppose to say the Super Conqueror, sorry. All we want to see, we want to see this guy shooting. Yeah, he's playing, he's side-scrapping over there. No? Come on, shoot. Just shoot. All I want you to shoot once, please. I think he just shot. Okay. Let's try to cross like so. Oh, I am wrong. Oh, I am so wrong. Oh, I am so wrong. I truly thought he fired. I truly thought he fired. That is my mistake, fellas. I truly thought this guy fired. I even hear that, but that was uh, 116, you know? I, I have a feeling that was 116. Doesn't really matter. It happens for the best of us. So, looking into the last game, I cannot blame the tank in this situation. I can blame only myself, fellas. This is a new map, and I have no clue how to play it yet. Plus, let's get real. I went into the heavy line, so <coughs> I could have simply load the gold ammunition in this situation right it will take some time until i will learn how to play this map and whenever i will i i think this map might get the guide how to play this map we are to go and how to do the things right anyways it is how it is uh we are forgetting about the last game um and we are checking the score after two games shall we and once again i cannot blame the tank here fellas th this map is new for me i played this map for a third time or a second time and every single time i score it badly i need to figure out how it works and how it is looking like that's all i need to do right Anyways, looking into all of this, uh, we played very, very well with Rhino. We kept our momentum, we kept our tempo, but the last game, you know, I cannot change it. It is the map. I do not know it yet. Or I supposed to say it's me because I do not know the map. Skill excuses, uh, shut the F up and um, end the video. Fine, you got me. Thank you very much for watching and see you next time. Skill is out for today. Peace.